Here, will you take this yet? Please. I'm in desperate need of... I need to get a core on it. <laughs> or something. Ah, oh, well. A minor inconvenience. Yeah. Religious unity is still 137%, so... We're good. Alright. Mm, wrong one. So there's two orthodox provinces here. Two there. A lot there. How are we doing, anyway? In the whole religion race. 243 to 253. It's definitely a possible end goal to finish them off before the end of the game if we push really hard into North Africa and West Africa now. Which we will be. Alright. We're almost through the hell period. Almost through the hell period. I'll conquer them too! Widespread. Fine. Could be worse. Like I said. 1787. We need to get things under control soon. You know what? Fine. Go the fuck ahead and revolt. Like, here. Where, where are you? Handle. Apparently not. Okay. It's gonna be like, here, can't you just defect to a Shia province, Shia nation or something? Come on. Good. Taken care of. Now we need to go deal with the other rebels. I'm going to primarily focus on taking out the armies first. Of course. I'm glad that they aren't my rival at this point. Because, like, we have a limited number of rivals we can have. <laughs> Very limited. Well, we need to get these. There we go. Core is taken. So now, July 1785, so two years out. Somewhere between two and four years at this point before Syria is ours. I'd also like to take that. Here. I'll just declare war on Shamar. They're allied with Yemen, that's not really a problem. Yeah, I want to get that done soon. Come on. Apparently we have no leader. I need to take care of that. All right, come on. Somebody's got to freaking have a leader here. Can't let nobody have one. Eh, good enough. That's great. Don't care. Alright. Venice has announced Ethiopia as their new rival. Well, it's not like they had many other options, let's be fair here. Like, uh, there aren't many states left in Europe. Bohemia is probably going to be annexed by the HRE pretty soon. Hungary just continues to exist, which have no right to. Poland's probably going to die sooner or later. <laughs> the HRE is going to gobble up Bohemia and Poland, I believe. Don't know about Hungary. Hungary might survive. I like Poland and the HRE. Huh. Huh. They're allowed the HRE. Somehow. Yep. Yeah. Glorious will Ethiopia be. Boom, boom, boom. Come on. Unfortunately, our leader got a little ahead of himself. He can go on vacation. There. <laughs> 
as fast as we can reinforce them. Alright, I don't think uh, Shamar and Yemen can stand up to my vassals, so they'll have that taken care of. Turkish patriots and all that. Yeah, we have like six months though. Then we'll have to core that by hand. Oh god, the horror. Alright, just to make sure. Good. Anything that we can convert, we will convert. Good. Alright. We'll have, uh, have, you know, Anatolia soon. Uh, let, let it fall. Cool. So we have one army left. Of rebels, anyway, to take care of. So you can invest in state propaganda. I like it. Good. We should probably kill Venice, take land from them. I really need to focus on taking over those Sunnis, because my last objective, I think, for this game... God damn it. Why is there even provincial unrest? Should it all be gone? Bloody hell. I'm not going to pay that much for a stability point. I will. I need that much. I just need every bit of stability I can get at this point. Anyway. Because soon, once this is annexed, we're much more powerful. Literally next month. Also, that's apparently no longer occupied. Cool. Really? Well, thanks for the reinforcements, just in time. Good. Now, burn. Alright, so now, this is no longer distant overseas. It means we can reduce autonomy here. And in fact, I think we shall. Because Greek, Gothic, they have no reason to revolt. Especially if we get our war exhaustion and overextension under control. I'm gonna hope they. Okay, yeah. no one rests there. Good. I mean, at this point, there's no reason not to for provinces that the Byzantines owned. There. Good. 50% reductions. Nope. <laughs> Why is that button even available? <sighs> These regions will also need their themselves reduced, since for some reason the game thought they were distant overseas. There. Cyprus is still distant overseas, so that's not going to work. <laughs> Alright, so there we are. That's a huge power boost. Suddenly have. Alright, deal with the damn armies. We need to deal with the remaining overextension, which will be dealt with pretty soon. With two more cores about to come in. Hey, six and three, damn. Alright, you'll have no problem killing this then. Regardless of their defensive abilities. With a six and fire. Boom, 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 boom. It's boom, 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 boom. Running out of front line, though. Alright. Keep it going. Battle of Kano, we lost? And my armies are... Oh, shit, we ran out of dudes in general, didn't we? Eee, that's, uh, that's not good. Well, 
That region's covered. We'll need we'll need to work. But we we've got this under control. Barely anything left in terms of uh unrest. We need those dudes. We need to get them here now. Because we need to... We, we just lost a chunk of our troops, so I'm not pleased. Um, you guys are still reinforcing. Alright, get to Antioch. We'll take care of that. Then we need to start taking care of these regions. And cleaning everything up. Do you have any siege at all? One siege. Better than none. Go. We'll leave the uh, army here. With haste. There. Right. Six fire. It's the right way to do it. <laughs> Just that way you know you come up with an extra three. United in prayer. Uh... Hmm. Yeah, I don't really care too much for Armenia's opinion. I mean, them being a vassal and all. Yeah. She has lots of no demands that they can enforce, so they aren't a problem. But we need to work fast. We need to start retaking everything. I'm assuming we win in Kano. Good. In that case, keep moving. We're almost through this, damn it. Almost through it all. We can do it. We can. I'm debating if I should, you know, let Theodoro out. <laughs> ah, well, whatever. So, Bohemia, still alive. Switzerland still alive. Lol. I guess we know whose empire is greater. It would be a great final fight. The HRE. Revolutionary France, I don't think it's going anywhere. They're fighting Miami. Oh. That's an actual tribe. I thought it was a colony name. Oh, dear. Dun, dun. So eventually we'll get Shamar down as well. Eventually. We hope. Rebels that are close to enforcing their demands. Sure. Good. Mecca's taken care of. There we are. Overextension value is only 30, so let's get up to 3 stability. Like, provincial unrest with 3 stability is ridiculous. Like, where, where is this unrest? Ah, okay. That's fine, then. I'm pretty much just trying to let my vassals uh, fight out over here. Good. Take care of that now. There. Despite losing several pieces of our armed forces, we still managed to handle it. And the reason I haven't rebuilt the armed forces is because this is probably the only chance we're going to get to repay this loan. <laughs> Twenty-nine fifty-nine is a lot of money. I don't often keep that on hand because I like to build buildings and stuff. You know it. it, 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 it. It's not that it is. It is a hard loan to repay. All right. Finest of horses and all that. Hey, what? These are not decisions I care to know about. Thank you. Nope. 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 None of these decisions I care about. All right. A lot of these reason regions are slowly losing out their autonomy. It's tempting to change governments to constitutional monarchy because, you know, the additional reduction, or perhaps even enlightened despotism. Hmm. 
Might happen. It might happen. Good. We've got everything controlled now. See? No issues. So, now we need to go take that core. There. Also, at some point, we need to go kick the Ottoman's ass in. Three years from now. They cannot be allowed to continue their existence there. Also, I think I need to move my... Does Alexandria feed into Constantinople? It does. 